It is an incredible survival story. You're about to meet a man who says it is a miracle. He is alive after his snowmobile crashed through the ice. He then spent three days stranded in the Alaskan wilderness, contending with sub-zero temperatures and also wild animals. And ABC's Aditi Roy is in our L.A. Bureau with more this morning. Aditi, good morning to you. Good morning, Dan. It is unbelievable. Craig Johnson's story almost feels like a myth. He battled sub-zero temperatures, a wolverine at his heels, and rescue choppers who flew right past him. But his will to live endured above all. This medical chopper sweeping into the pitch dark frozen wilderness, rescuing 34 year old Craig Johnson from a nightmare in northern Alaska. Somebody up there still watching over me. Johnson still in disbelief. He made it out alive after his snowmobile fell through a frozen sea in northern Alaska while traveling to see his family. I crawled up the bank. I was walking every time I stepped. You could hear water in my boots. His clothes frozen, his lung punctured and the temperature 35 degrees below zero. Johnson trekking 30 miles looking for help. A father of two boys desperate and determined not to end up like his father who he says drowned after falling through the ice in 1998. It's just my will to survive. You know they you know I just Learn to live off the land, you know. Johnson then facing another unbelievable challenge, a wolverine. I didn't panic or anything. I just kept going. My heart didn't want to stop. The ferocious animal chasing him. Johnson finding protection in this wooden box. Searchers now trying to find him, but the choppers flying right past him. That when they just passed right by me, I just... I just couldn't stop crying when I was out there when they passed by me. I lost all hope and I just laid back down in that box I was in and it just felt like that was an open grave for me. But after three days alone in the wilderness, one searcher, Johnson's cousin, hearing his cries. I couldn't even scream, but somehow some, something inside me told, made me scream at him. Tell him I'm right here. Johnson is recovering from his injuries on how he survived the unthinkable. His cousin says they are Alaska tough. Yeah. So true. Dan and Amy. Wow. To see his, his emotion. I mean, yeah. he's so happy to be. And I love seeing that Christmas tree behind him. Mm -hmm. It's all, you know, he, he gets the moment and, and what he lived through. And Absolutely. I'm so happy that he's, well, I, I, don't, I can't imagine. No, in that situation. he's not just Alaska tough. He's yeah. tough by any standard. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Oof.